What's up, y'all? Team is in the house. Now we got another uh, Masterverse figure. This is from the New Adventures of He Man cartoon. We got Skeletor. I, this figure looks pretty wicked. Um, I'm going to try to keep it short as possible because we all got things to do and I want to relax because it's been a long day. Anyways, uh, rad, man. There's his uh, skull planet ship thing or whatever planetoid thing. Really awesome art, man. Really cool. Killer, killer, killer artwork. Looks awesome. And, uh, yeah, man, New Adventures Skeletor, dude, really neat. Um, once again, I wasn't into uh, New Adventures He-Man when it was originally out. I was probably about 13 years old or so when this was launching. Maybe maybe a little bit younger. But uh, but as I've grown older, I've been more open-minded about it, and I, I dig it more now. I think it's kind of uh, just an interesting, different take and a nice new uh, add to the ever-growing multiverse of He-Man. Anyways, uh, but, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, check this figure out open him up. And here he is, folks. I, I think this pretty much rivals classics man uh for sure i don't have the classics version i do have the vintage version but yeah this thing is freaking rad dude crazy 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 you can see the tech stuff on the back of his head these weird coils going into his brain it's an interesting new take on him i mean it's a it's it's pretty much does pay homage to the old school version man it's not totally identical but yeah it's not totally uh yeah, I don't know. It's cool, man. It's cool. I dig it, dude. Get a closer look at the skull face. I mean, that's Skeletor, dude, for sure. That's rad. He's got this crazy girly cape. He's got a bunch of techno stuff on his back, too. All kinds of circuitry and stuff and hoses and tubers going through about his legs. His boots. Even though they're blue, they should be more purple, but it's not really that big a deal. Um, yeah, his arms go out, biceps, double elbows, two grippy hands, does pretty decent splits, he's got waist, he's got, um, I don't know about his midriff, whatever, like, not much, not too much going on there, really, doesn't seem like, but you got his waist, though, um, upper thigh, double knees, boot cut, and then a rocker pivot, Looks like it's kind of detented too. It's ankle joint, but it's not going to swivel 360. You really don't need it to. It's not necessary. Uh, yeah, man. Pretty neat. All the details all the way around. Even in his shorts. The skull right there. Here's his uh, staff. The skull on it. That's pretty rad. The knife thing. And his helmet. Very much like the vintage version too, but yeah, we'll go ahead and get his helmet on. And uh, there you go, man. That's pretty badass. That is cool, man. And get him geared up. This is rad. This is freaking rad. We'll go ahead and uh, yeah, get him posed. And up. here we have him, folks, posed up and ready for battle, man. He looks really cool. I like him a lot, man. He looks really tough, really neat. Um, yeah, man. New adventure stuff, man. Really. Really welcome more of it. And as a special guest, we have our vintage version of him right next to him so yeah colors aren't identical the boots are purple it's pretty much uh not too far off though man they're not, they're not too far off as far as the chest goes chest plate some little paint apps are different you know belts pretty much kind of uh, a little bit of the same a little different too um it's not totally identical it's not gold it's more of a silvery uh look or whatever this is more like a brassy, dingy gold or whatever for his helmet and his staff and his uh, panties or whatever. And then it's almost the, kind of the same design too on the back, if you look. And um, I almost like this cape better on him than this cape. It seems kind of weird. Uh, and even these little panels right there on his thighs. It's pretty cool. I mean, you can't expect it to be identical, but it's still pretty kick-ass because it's got to be its own thing, too, if it's Masterverse and stuff. It's got to be kind of its own own thing. It can't be a classic. It can't be a vintage. It can't be, you know, totally, you know, the same thing. But uh, there's this helmet. So if we want to do also helmet comparisons. It's pretty neat, man. It's tough. It's pretty tough, dude. It's cool, man. It looks badass. Really cool. Then the old one had this cool little gimmick where you could put your thumb right there. And, uh, yeah, man, your finger, if I could do this, man, my big old man hands, but yeah, like battle, battle He-Man stuff, where He-Man and him could battle, rah, rah, that's cool, man, 
Still fun, man. Still fun little gimmick. And you can take his helmet off, which is a little bit the same, a little different too. I would say pretty different though, because there's a little bit of green, kind of a new take on it. it. Does have the same tuber things though in the back, so this kind of makes sense. But a little bit more color though, a little bit more paint apps, so that's kind of cool too. But yeah, you can watch this cartoon on Peacock. I don't know if you can watch it on the Mattel site or something on YouTube. I don't know if they have it on YouTube because sometimes they they have I think have stuff like this on YouTube. But if you have Peacock or whatever, you can watch it on that streaming service for that network. But uh, yeah, fun fig. Either way, man, it was cheesy for back in the day, but I don't know. I like them now, dude. I think they're cool. I have a decent little collection of uh, of, uh New Adventures of He-Man stuff, and yeah, I don't mind them, man. I don't mind them at all. But yeah, that's our quick look at uh, New Adventures He-Man. Or New Adventures Skeletor, I mean. <laughs> uh man. Either way, I don't know. He's rad, man. I like him a lot. Anyways, I guess we'll do a couple size comparisons real quick and then be done. Alrighty, folks, and for size comparisons, here he is next to Hordak, which he is taller than Hordak, dude. Uh, It's pretty cool, man. I think either with or without the helmet, I think he's a little bit taller. Or just, yeah. I think with the helmet, he's, he's a lot taller. But, um, and uh, Captain Adam and Mark Mothersbaugh from uh, Devo. Yeah, he's... uh. Quite a menacing figure, man. He's taller than a freaking uh, than Captain Adam, though. Yeah, for sure. And uh, anyways, let's sort of look at a uh, Skeletor from New Adventures of He-Man from uh, Masterverse. Really cool, man. I don't think it says New Adventures either. I just think it says uh, Skeletor He-Man. That's it. But anyways, uh, once again, uh, thanks for watching. On have a good one. All right, later.